What's up guys, welcome to Danny's Tech and in this video I will be lapping uh, MSI Core Forza L CPU cooler to see if we can lower the temps. So we're going to lap the heat um, spreader at the bottom. So we're going to first start with uh, 400 grit just on a piece of glass from a... Um, I got this glass from a... Uh, fish tank so we're going to use this so it's nice and flat we're going to put water on here so this uh, so it's easier to slide across um, at the moment I get the temperatures with my Ryzen 5 2600X uh, while gaming is 65 degrees while gaming so if we can lower it by even just two or three degrees will be um, doing a, uh, it, that proves that the lapping actually works I'll I'll be using sandpaper with some water I'm gonna start off at 400 then I'm gonna go up to 800 and then finish with about a thousand grit so I'm gonna take this outside because I don't want to um, make a mess inside my room so let me just get everything set up outside and then I'll be right back. All right guys, I'm back and now we're outside on my balcony. So sorry if, if there's any bird sounds or cars going by. So we're gonna start off by adding a little bit of water to the sandpaper. That okay, that should be enough. So what I'm thinking of doing we're going to go this way and then we're going to turn it go this way turn it go this way turn it go this way and also going to do some diagonal thing uh, um, motions to see if we can how smooth this um, um, block is so let's start so let's go this way first so you want to keep it all nice and level and even. Just jump in a little bit. Let's turn it. So this is going to take a while so Maybe if I just slide it back, it'd be easier. I can already see some metal residue coming off. I'm not trying to make it shiny or anything. I just want it to see if we can make it more flat. So, let's take a look. Oh, already you can see that the copper is starting to show through. So that means this area here was actually higher than the middle. So we want to get it so it's all copper and all flat. So I'll pause the video. I continue doing this and then I'll come back when I move on to the 800 grit. So let me just do this and then I'll be right back. So guys, after 15 minutes of lapping, we've got to this point here so as you can see the middle was a lot lower than the sides this bit here is still a little bit low but all the rest is now showing copper so we have to keep going to this is all copper then we can move on to the higher grit so I'll keep going and I'll be right back so guys I've been lapping for the last 40 minutes and we're finally at this point it's still a little bit of um, nickel plate in here so it shows actually how that this was not flat at all it was there's still only a little bit so fine so I'm gonna move up to a higher grit just to smooth this out and then I'll be right back okay 
All right, guys. After an hour of lapping, we're finally we're finally all copper. So it should be all level now. I'm not going for a mirrored finish here. I, mean, I want some like indentations, just so the thermal paste can grip. They're not too deep. You can just just feel them. So the way I did it was, if you go this way. 10 times then turn it then go this way 10 times then turn it again go this way 10 times then turn it again then you can also go diagonal from side to side like this but the most important thing is keep it flat make sure you keep it flat so you don't get any um, uneven edges so let's do a few more so now all I have to do is clean this up and get it back in my rig so once I've got this cleaned up and back in the rig I'll be right back okay guys I'm back I've been doing some testing with um, cyberpunk I've been playing for the last hour so let's close the game Exit the game. Then see what the temps are. Before I was getting about 65 degrees before lapping. So now the CPU temperature got to, oh, 64 degrees. So lapping only reduced the temperature by one degrees. So was it worth lapping the um, MSI uh, Core Forza um, CPU cooler? In my opinion, the time it took to do it, no. So I don't recommend lapping the CPU cooler. Some might have better, different results, but in my case, I only dropped one degrees. And just to prove that it's still the seal, the same one, here it is in the case. So, but if the temps change after the thermal pace has um, cured a little bit, I'll let you know in the description below. So, if you like this video, put a thumbs up, um, subscribe, and leave any comments for any other videos you'd like me to do. I'll see if I can arrange to do those videos. So, thanks for watching guys, and see you in the next one. Have a good day.